Hey, what's up, folks? So this is um, uh, the H128 mini boat. This is a toy grade. This is a cheap boat from AliExpress. It's cost around, cost around 21 euro or let's say 24 US dollars. It is great, really. So not to take this long. Though. So this transmitter, I turn it on, and it, underneath it are two AA batteries. There we have the extra battery there. It's an option. I picked the two battery option. You can have one battery for a cheaper price. So. And the screwdriver, the two extra propels, the manual itself, the charger, this exclusive charger. So you have to take care of this one. Like it's really delicate; it can get ripped off right away. So the charging time is around 90 minutes, according to the manual. The cover it has a rubber lining, so it should seal the insides and make this waterproof. And I believe this toy grade boat, uh, when it comes to waterproofing, it beats the rest of the um, happy grade boats out there because they really suck a lot of water in. Maybe most of them. Yeah. So not take this long. So what's inside? 3.7 volt battery 650 milliamps um, I, I believe it's a nickel nickel battery I don't know if it's lithium ion or nickel cadmium so whatever or nickel metal hydride and two two motors this is a one uh, I believe this is a 180 motor small motors brushed motors of course and two propellers here and uh, we have the rudder it can be manually manually adjusted well of course I choose to have it straightened and the two water sensors so it has to be wet to be able to run okay just for some safety purposes because kids can play this boat so not, uh, not to make this video longer so immediately I'm gonna turn this on what I'm gonna do is we're gonna connect with, with the wire since we don't have water around to wet this. Uh, I'm going to connect this yeah, here. So I'm gonna, yeah, so there's a wire connecting the two. Okay, I'm gonna hold it in place. So here's a go. So there, you cannot adjust the speed. It's either go or stop or reverse, left or right. It's a go. Stop. Then backwards. And if you steer to the left, so they spin in opposite directions. If you steer to the left or right, opposite directions for the boat to turn this way or this way. So well, it's brilliant, really. And also, the last option is when you go forward and you steer to the right. So you can still have the function of a, of a normal boat that has a rudder. So you can st uh, go forward and steer to the right while going forward. Okay, so well, that's it. Pretty straightforward boat. Uh, it should be fun for both kids and adults like me, who are who are kids at heart. Yeah. <laughs> so. This is it. It's a compact boat. You know why I bought this boat? Primarily, uh, this is a rescue boat actually. Well, most of the time, this thing, my hobby grade boat, uh, gets stuck in the middle of water. Maybe there's some footage cut off or ESC failure or whatever failure, there, servo failure, so I can't get it back. So. Well, I decided to buy this one, of course, to push this towards me and back to the, back to the surface. Uh, uh, also, when this boat flips, this has no self-riding feature, sadly, because the KV is too high, there's less torque to flip it back on. So, of course, this boat's going to push this right towards me, and well, bam, bam, boom. And sadly, this boat has no self-writing feature, so when it gets flipped, it's dead. Well, it's there forever. No, no. By the way, 
the way it's really hard to flip this boat because it has low power and and you know it's stable you can see its body it's catamaran design yeah the only thing that can flip this boat are waves big waves so avoid playing it on the sea with big waves or also and also animals like ducks or angry crocodiles yeah you know so well that's it pretty straightforward boat so we're here let's do this let's do this thing yeah. This thing. Oh, it's a bit slow. So that's a turn. It's a bit slow, but and turn around. Reverse. Slow reverse. Nothing. So this thing is right there. Yes, it's still so I can't tell it's loud. I'm going to try to rescue my boat. Just assume that my boat is, is stuck somewhere, so let's try to rescue my boat, yeah. Wrong one. There it's stuck. Yeah. Shoot. It's rescue time. It's a recovery boat. Huh? Good enough for recovery. That's it. That was able to recover my boat safely. Oh man, it's so slippery in here. It's so scary. That's it for the boat. On the sand, it's wet or not. Of course, it's not wet. No, look at that. No water inside. No water inside. 